is nice and early, maybe seven o'clock. I've just come out. The sky is beautiful this morning. I've just come out for a little run. Like I said yesterday in the vlog, I haven't been running for maybe a week or so. So yeah, I just wanted to get out. It looked nice, so I'm coming out for a quick run. again that going for a run in the morning definitely is one of the best things you can do I think like for happiness well, that sounds a bit cheesy does it but it's so it's just getting up in the morning it's so often I lie in bed and I'm like oh I can't be bothered, can't be bothered but as soon as you make the effort to get up come out out in this especially here like just countryside all around me like I haven't seen anyone yet I've been out for like 20 minutes Oh, it's just amazing. Even if you don't go for a run, just go for a walk, you can. Oh, it's amazing. I'm right, heading back now. It's quite hilly around here, so it's quite a difficult little run. I'm back. This one's still asleep. Lazy thing. Right, time to grab a quick shower and then do some work, I think, to be better to. That was so good. I'm all showered and ready for the day now. I just wanted to have a little quick chat with you just about um, the work away. I know I've been talking about saying what on a work away and I don't know whether, whether you know what a work away is particularly. But there's this website, I think there's loads of websites, but the one I use is workaway.info and people all over, like literally all over the world can just post that they want some help. Generally it's about five hours, um, five days a week. It can be so many different things, like literally anything you want doing, whether it's like building, carpentry, um, teaching, uh, farm work, like any, literally anything you want doing, um, you can post on this website and then people like me and think, oh, I'd like to go and visit, you know, X place and could just go and stay in that person's house. So you get like free accommodation and food is generally provided. So that's what we're doing here. We're with a family where the help is really just kind of help with the kids, help around the house and stuff. So today is obviously Monday, so it's kind of like working day type of thing. So it's just having with the kids for mom and things like that. And maybe this in the evening, helping out with the kids. So you know, that like they can get stuff done or whatever. But yeah, so that's what we're doing. So I'm gonna go and uh, see mum now and sort of see what the plan is for the day. I figured today I might kind of do like a little day in the life thing of what we kind of do on the work away. It might be quite interesting for some people who are maybe interested in uh, doing workaways. Obviously they're all different, uh, but it is, what time is it now? It's 12 o'clock, so this morning I haven't done anything. I've just been like doing personal stuff for me, like doing editing, um, playing on some games and stuff. But now mum's nipped out for a meeting at school, so I'm just staying looking after the little girl, the 18 month old, um, and just finishing off doing the lunch while she's at that meeting for maybe like half an hour, 45 minutes or so. It really isn't, um, like I said, they're all different obviously, but they work, all the workaways that I've been on have all been like kind of teaching ones or like child related ones and none of them have been particularly hard work or anything. So it's definitely, definitely a good way of traveling I think and it makes you see places like I would never have come to this part of France. Um, so it, like gets you to different places that you probably wouldn't have gone to. Hello. Got your shoes. Thank you. For me. Do you want them on? Want to sit on my knee? Want to get up? Up. Yeah. Right, just put you down to continue this uh, conversation. So, yeah, it's definitely you go to different places that you wouldn't necessarily go to, and you just get involved more in kind of the culture and everything. And I think it's a really good way of travelling. Obviously, I mean, I say obviously, but generally you're not in like the big cities and things so you're not maybe seeing like the the most touristy places but i kind of like that about it that um you get in to see the real france or the real wherever um wherever you're going you want these on right i'll speak to you in a little bit
Tu veux que We finished lunch, we had lunch with mum. There is like the leftovers, the remnants of lunch. Um, mum's gone to put the um, little girl to bed now. Kind of that's it for the afternoon really. I think we'll just, I'll go and do some more editing. Um, days like, I mean we could go out really, but I just need to catch up on some editing. Um, Cause I'm a little bit behind, <laughs> yikes. Uh, but normally we possibly like in the afternoon could go on a bike ride or something or. Mum. 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 Oh. <laughs> um, yeah, normally we could go out, I don't know, like go on a bike ride or go out, I don't know what we could do, but you know, we could go out, that's kind of free time I think now, we could do what we want, but today's free time is going to be taken up with work unfortunately. Right, you're going to help me uh, clear this mess? Just put the, <laughs> oh, Stephen doesn't like this, he has to do things, he's not, um, it's my fault really, I don't really encourage him to do things at home, like this, or make him, I say make him, make him, encourage him, and um, um but yeah, come on, help out. Put the cling film back over the rice and put the ketchup away and stuff. He should really do things. He's like 12 years old. He should help out. Okay, I finished the editing and stuff that I wanted to do. I was going to go out for a little walk. In fact, we should have really gone out for a little, little walk or something this afternoon. But we kind of just didn't end up doing. It's about maybe like 4 o'clock-ish or something now. Oh, gone a bit dark. Walk right from the window. Yeah, 4 o'clock. So I'm going to go downstairs, see what the deal is. See um, if they need my help with anything. Maybe it's time to pick. I don't actually know what time they finish school here in France. I need to find that out. Um, yeah, I'm gonna go downstairs. Okay, I'm downstairs. I've just been emailing some people trying to find another work away. I think I mentioned that the other day that I need to get one set up for like the end of February for like two weeks' time or so. But I found out school finishes like sort of like half past four, quarter five. Mum's gone to collect, so I am looking after the little one here. We're playing. You're gonna catch. The older child's back from school now, so we've got the two of them. Mum's just doing a few errands and some things, so we're just kind of playing with them and looking after them for a little bit. Stephen, Stephen likes the little ones. You like playing with the little ones, don't you? Yeah, he definitely does. What's the ball gone? Oh, don't do that. Okay, so my kind of day in the life thing. Kind of stopped, didn't it? But basically, what happened was, um, Dad came home. Me and Mum went shopping. When I'm talking about Dad, I'm talking about other family, obviously that we're staying with. Um, we went shopping. Stephen stayed here. I'm out of focus. Stephen stayed here. We actually went shopping. Came home, just looked after the kids for a little bit. Um, whilst Mum made tea, we've just finished eating and just kind of cleared away. It's just kind of like being like part of the family really and just helping out it's really really fine look Stephen I've just been at the shop I bought some gloves I bought you some gloves Stephen yay they're yours I think they'll fit yeah um because we've been so cold and when we were at the um supermarket there was like this little aisle this little not aisle a little like bin of hats and gloves and scarves and everything and I was gonna buy a hat and I thought I don't know that it's that cold but is it really did you want a hat Stephen would you have wanted a hat? No, I didn't think so. I was going to buy a hat and then I didn't thought maybe not. Definitely gloves. So I bought gloves. And this co these cost, it was like half price or 70% off or something. So I paid three euros for two pairs of gloves. Bargain. They're not the nicest of colours, are they, Stevens? But they'll do. I think I'm going to end it now. It's only like quarter past eight, but I think I'm probably just going to do a little bit of work um, this evening. Maybe just have an early night, to be honest. I'm going to try and go running again tomorrow because I so enjoyed it this morning. So there you go, that is kind of what we do on a day-to-day -day basis on this work away. Obviously every day is slightly different, there's different things going on. Um, we can go out, obviously today we kind of stayed in on our like free time, but in other, on other days we're going to maybe venture out and go and visit some local places and things. Apparently there's quite a few castles and stuff around here. Um, but yeah, let me know down below if you've ever done anything like this, if you've ever done any sort of volunteering whilst you're travelling or work away or also like house sitting is something that I've been looking into a little bit as well. Let me know if you've done anything like that down below, I'd love to hear about it. But thank you for watching today and I will see you tomorrow. Good night. <laughs>